Hi, welcome to another video. So, a new model has come along that has made me extremely excited. This one is called Kimi K2. Kimi K2 is basically an open source model by Kimi AI, which is a Chinese company, and this is probably the biggest open source model yet. It's a one trillion parameter mixture of experts language model. Yeah, you heard that right a trillion parameters, with 32 billion of them activated at any given time. It has the same structure as DeepSeq V3 or R1. But the best part is that they've open-sourced the whole thing, and you can actually try it out for free, which is quite awesome. You can even run it on your own servers privately, which is pretty awesome. So, a bit of background first. Moonshot AI has been working on these massive MOE LLMs for a while, and Kimi K2 is their latest and greatest. It comes in two flavors. Kimi K2 Base, which is more for folks who want to tinker, fine-tune, or build their own stuff. And Kimi K2 Instruct, which is the one you'll probably want for general chat and agentic tasks. The Instruct version is basically ready to drop into your projects and it's designed to be super fast, like reflex speed responses. It doesn't do any thinking either, and it is still comparable to the SOTA models with that. Now, you know it's going to be awesome when a model provider compares their model not to Sonnet, but to Opus. Yes, they have compared the model to Opus, and it comes extremely close to it, even beating it in some cases, which is too good if true and it probably is, based on my initial testing. In SWE Bench Verified, the model beats DeepSeek by a wide margin, as well as DeepSeek, Quen, and OpenAI. It comes extremely close to the Opus model here. In Live Code Bench, it also beats all of them, including the Claude 4 Opus model. It is also amazing in the tool Use Benchmarks, as well as Amy and whatnot, while being open weights, which is amazingly good. It actually beats Sonnet in a ton of benchmarks, which is awesome. Like, really good. They have also shared how they have trained it and everything. The model is available for fully free use, without any limits on their chat platform, and the API for it is available on their platform. You can easily sign up and use the model through their official API. And if we talk about the API pricing, then it is amazingly cheap. It costs 15 cents or 60 cents based on cash hit or cash miss, and just $2.50 for output, which is four times cheaper than something like Sonnet or Gemini Pro, which is insanely awesome. I mean, the pricing is awesome for the API, as well as it's free on their chat platform, and it is open weights while beating Sonnet and Gemini, and the recent atrocious Grok 4, which, by the way, costs even more if you use above the 128k context window, which is hilarious in front of this price. Nothing after Grok 1 is yet open-sourced, and it isn't even needed now. Anyway, it's not just cheap, but also free. Yes, the API has a free tier. You get 32k tokens per minute for free, along with 3 requests per minute and 1.5 million tokens a day, which is awesome to try it as well. Anyway, let me show you how you can configure it with things like Klein, Rue, and Kilo. But before we do that, let me tell you about Ninja Tools. Ninja Tools is an AI platform that combines all the best AI models and experiences at one place. It allows you to save over $600 per year compared to having separate subscriptions. You get access to Claude, 3.7 Sonnet, GPT-4.0, Gemini, and a ton of others models in one subscription. You even get some more cool options like AI video generation, image generation, music generation, and document chats. You can also use their playground to compare multiple AI responses at once. The best part is that it just starts from $11 per month that gives you more than 1,000 chat messages, 30 AI images image generation, and 5 music generation, while there is also some even more advanced plans 
if you need them. Also, make sure to use my coupon code AICODEKING20 to get an additional 20% off. Make sure to check Ninja Tools out and save some money on your subscription while you're at it. Now, back to the video. You can just head on over to VS Code and then just upgrade Klein, Rue, and Kilo to the latest. Then head on over to Klein or Rue or Kilo based on what you like. With Kilo, you'll get $20 of free credits that you can use with things like this new model, as well as Sonnet and everything. You can also get it configured with the direct API of Kimi as well. I'll be using that here, but all of them have the same settings. So just head on over to the settings and just create a new profile here as well. Then select the Kilo Code option and select the Kimi K2 model if that is available. Or you can also use it via Open Router when that gets available. But the one that is available and most reliable is the one by Kimi themselves. So you can just hit the Open AI Compatible option and then enter the model endpoint of Kimi and then enter the API key as well as the name and everything. And then you should be able to use the model in here as well. I have tested the model and I can say that it is really good. It is great at tool calling and actually insanely capable. The whole way that it works is insanely similar to something like Sonnet. It's way better than Grok 4 as a coder, which is insane to see. It is super cheap and super good at the same time. And it is also open weights, which makes me so happy that I can't express it in words. The code writing capabilities of it are quite good, and for the price, I don't think anything beats it. It is super cheap in the API, and doesn't cost you a ton to do coding with AI or something. It is amazingly good based on my initial tests, especially with the daily AI coder that I drive, which is Kilo or Klein or Roo. It works amazingly well with that. I can't really express in words how happy I am with this release. It is such a good model that is open weights. This is the DeepSeek V4 that I was waiting for. And this is the non-thinking variant, meaning that we'll soon see a thinking variant of this, which will blow away all the models with thinking like Sonnet or Gemini out of the water. I am insanely excited. I had recently covered in a members-only video how good the Kimi researcher was and I was really hooked on using it, and this model is even better. I have used it enough that I can give you a verdict that this is probably the model that I'm going to be switching to for a bit to use, because I think that I can save a ton of costs with this while having all the great capabilities that I need. The only thing that it is missing as of now is vision, which is a bit of a bummer, but I'm not complaining because this model is insanely good at what it aims to do. I hope we get some distilled variants of this model soon as well. That can be run on consumer-grade hardware. I was genuinely impressed by this biggest open weights model yet that I have seen. I don't know where the Llama Behemoth is, but I don't think that we even need that anymore. Overall, it's pretty cool. Anyway, share your thoughts below and subscribe to the channel. You can also donate via Super Thanks option or join the channel as well and get some perks. I'll see you in the next video. Bye.